There's another dash camera for the car. Oh, that's been damaged as well. Because the one that I've got doesn't charge the battery very well. It does sometimes. If you tap it a bit, gently, then the battery does start charging. So there's obviously something a bit loose inside. I have taken it apart before and adjusted things. But it's not a very high quality one. You really can't read number plates on it, that sort of thing. So I was looking for another relatively cheap one. I think this was about 30 quid, thereabouts, a bit more, but not much more. So it's still a relatively cheap one. Not a very robust looking connector. Oh well, we'll find out when we stick it in the car. USB, HDMI. Charger. Hopefully I can use the one that I've already got in the car, because that's all nicely behind the bodywork, out the way. I wonder if it's got any power in it at the moment. That looks like on-off. Yeah, blue light's coming on. Uh, well, it did come on. Battery low. Okay, well I'll stick that on charge and then I'll put it in the car. And we might have a video later on, see what sort of picture we get out of it. I'm just stepping through the menu functions here while we're charging it up. Push in the middle button there brings up the menu. If I push it a second time it steps over to the settings menu. Third time back to the screen. So let's step down is up and down. Resolution. Oh press the wrong button. <laughs> OK buttons are the top one. We'll do that again. Right. Step down, resolution, OK. 1080 FHD, 1920 by 1080. Well, we'll leave it at that. OK. Loop recording. Three minutes. Yeah, that's OK. Exposure value. Leave that as it is, zero. Motion detection. We'll leave that off. Record audio. I usually have that turned off so you don't hear a swearing in the car. But I'll leave it on for now. Date stamp. We'll leave that on. I haven't set the date yet. G sensor. That's when it detects whether you've had an accident or not and locks the files so they can't be overwritten. Leave that off for now. HDR. HDR. I can't remember what HDR was. Reading the instructions. Let's have a look. Oh, high, dyna high dynamic range, isn't it, I think? Which is supposed to give you better quality pictures. <coughs> 
HDR present a crisp and clear picture quality with harmonious contrast in a high contrast, high discrepancy environment. We'll leave it off for now, but then I'll try it on at a later date. Okay, is that our oh, license plate? That's where we can input the license plate, I think, so it displays on the screen for this car. We'll leave that off for now. Press that middle button again. Comes across to this one. Park mode. I think that switches it on if somebody bumps your car while it's parked. Date and time. Right, we want to do that. 2018, okay. Uh, 12, we want. Fourth time eleven. Year, month, day, yeah, we'll leave it like that for now. Okay, how do we get out of that? Press that again. Yeah, done that. Auto power off. We'll leave it off. Screen saver. We'll leave that off for now. Beep sound. On. Language. English, yes. Frequency. We're in the UK, 50 hertz. Flash. Off. Yeah. Format. Oh, yes, we ought to do that. Okay, that appears to have done it. We've just put the settings in so we don't want to go back to default. And that's the version number. Right, so that's gone through the settings. turns the speaker, uh, not speaker, microphone on and off. Oops, wrong button. Yeah, don't know if you can just see up there, the little icon comes up to indicate the microphone switched on and off. Uh, I think that's about it. mode now that's camera mode playback and record mode bottom one's on off Yep. Oh, that button is the lock button. That'll stop you overwriting or erasing anything. So in the event of an accident, you're supposed to remember to press that if it hasn't done it automatically. 
And then the top button, I would think, which is the OK button, will also start recording. Let's press it and find out. Please insert C6 and above card. Oh, so the memory card I put in there wasn't good enough. Ah, oh, that's good. Well, we'll have to have a look. <laughs> so I've gone through all that and I need to change the memory card. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily. So don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.